What is this dude's plan? This is the dumbest Viking in existence. This tutorial is so painfully slow. Oh. Is that Nova Starcraft? Oh, I don't. I think Sarah's okay, Jim. That that doesn't sound like Sarah screaming. Yep, like riding a bike. God damn. That was cute. Like that's a cute scene. I can sense them down there, but I don't think I should control them again. Why? Why don't you think you should control them, Sarah? Just tell them to go away. We've been through worse together. I love how that ghost still has a voice line, even though he is definitely super dead. So, fun fact. The gas defenses don't kill the tanks. Uh, and this is a siege breaker. We do not want to fight a siege breaker, so we're going to release the Zerg. <laughs> look, also, look how dumb this is. Look how dumb this is. Oh no, the bridge! It blowed up! What are we gonna do? What do you mean? Sarah could literally just lift him across the gap. Look, she can easily lift a suit of marine armor. Easily. That's a good line. That That's a good line right there. We're fine. Not even close, guys. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> oh, man. She was a bit or eager to give up control. It just shows that even Zergs can have subs. Grasp. Kerrigan makes things so easy. I forgot a queen. Can you guys let up for like two seconds? So we take all our little drones, add them to shift two. <laughs> drones are Zerglings, guys. Drones are Zerglings. It's okay, even in my infinite stupidity, I still ended up doing enough damage to win. <laughs> what are the fucking odds that this newscast starts playing at this moment? Uh, fun fact about roaches, for those of you who didn't know, they regenerate way faster uh, while burrowed. Thank you, Abathur, but I already told them that. You're being repetitive and unnecessary. And truly, what use are you if I'm doing your job for you? Hey, that's mean and racist. Fun fact, if you just send Zerglings to the objectives, They'll nibble it down, oftentimes, before the flash freeze can even finish. So that's how we're going to beat the mission. You just send Zerglings at the objective until it dies. How'd they do? They literally almost won. That was like eight Zerglings. If I had sent one more group of Zerglings, we would have won there. <laughs> and just, you ignore the entire base. Like, look, you just, you just send, you, you don't have to fight this shit. Just send Zerglings. <laughs> just send Zerglings. Oh, the spires are How have you guys been living here for years? In the freezing cold. Without something like that. Also, how did Noctul die? Or uh, Safash, whatever the the queen's name was. Like, the, the Protoss just roll over so easily on this mission. On one hand, we showed up here and the Protoss are like, die. On the other hand... Kerrigan is still a ruthless psychopath. <laughs> Adrenaline, stress response, imminent threat, no threat to you, no anger. I'll be the judge of that. <laughs> Abathur's like, bitch, chill. I am only doing my job. Uh-oh. Nope, 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 nope. Why don't they destroy this? Like... I know for uh, from a gameplay perspective why this is, but why not just destroy this? My enemies will never stop coming for me. All I can do is fight. So I'm going to give them more reason to hate me by killing civilians. And so we go from the infinity value zergling 
to the literally negative value Zerg, like Sarah War Crimes Kerrigan. So while she's on move command, I'm just gonna hold down the Zergling button. Because that's a basically how you win this mission. We have 60 seconds to get to the last one. So we can just poop out Zerglings forever. And there is basically nothing they can do. And now we just have to kill this High Templar. Does he not storm? Wait. He just stormed himself. What? What? <laughs> that is the, the most brain dead High Templar I've ever seen. That was... That was real uh paper one plays he would rather die on his own terms i mean i guess but like i st i thought he was gonna like storm in front of him but he waited until after i pulled back questioned his ai and then when i was giving him the attention he wanted he stormed himself <laughs> it's just the timing of it was perfect <laughs> Isha, shut the fuck up! No one asked you! So yeah, I think we're gonna go with the Vile Strain. The Vile Strain is just really, really good all around. So yeah, slows enemy movement and attack speeds by 75%. If you survive. I love how hard Zeratul goes with Raynor and how hard he goes with Kerrigan and you guys spoiler alert we'll see how hard he goes with uh Artanis in the next game like this dude is the only reason that the entire universe continues to exist Zeratul is putting in work unacceptable must be wiped clean no trace left <laughs> Abathur fucking hates the primal zerk the Primal Zerg stole our fucking NFTs, bro. Hashtag copy paste. <laughs> Hashtag control save. <laughs> this is like the last hard, really hard mission of the run. The rest can you, you can pretty much brute force. <laughs> because Kerrigan becomes so OP. Uh, we're going to take these little guys. Hey, uh-oh. Lost a queens. Save the queen. 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 <laughs> she survived. We're good. Uh, and we're just gonna build an ass load of spines. No. Uh oh. <gasps> Wait, what's that? How'd he get that? Guys, I think we made her mad. Oh, a little bit. Only a lot. What are you looking at, man? Look at Kerrigan's micro. She's insane. Come on. Kill, 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 kill. There we go. Uh, fun fact. It is so much safer to just leave these guys here. This is like a super dangerous area and I'd really rather have them for the final fight. So yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to take Kerrigan and we're going to walk. And we're going to walk. And we're going to walk. And then we're going to dash. And we're going to walk. And we're going to dash. And we're going to walk and dash. And dash. And dash. Uh-huh. Is this a challenge? You can also get them on seven different screens at once. Don't judge me like this. And dash. And dash. And we're in the boss arena. And we have all of our units. So yeah, don't don't bother trying to run your units through the infinity banelings. Just because they're going to die here anyway. Like, look how many banelings we have to deal with. Oh, look. He betrayed us. Who could have seen that coming? Just trying to hold your hand. Oh, okay. I've seen enough hentai to know where this is going, boys. <laughs> I, oh, I shifted right into it. I have to restart. No. <laughs> Red light. Green light. Also, his attack is really loud. Do you guys know that? So, there's an interesting cheese for this mission. This is Zagara's main. You can spawn camp Zagara forever with Kerrigan, especially if you're a uh, primal Kerrigan, because there's there nothing she can do to you. Th from this position, there is basically nothing Zagara can do. Oh, look at that. They won without, even without Kerrigan. 
No! If you're too weak to kill my minions, you deserve to die. So we're just gonna take all of our units and like little put them in a little bolly right here. And then we as once we have this nice, beautiful little ball. Oh, you, can you feel the frames? We just a move into the back of her base. <laughs> Dahaka goes over, licks the outside of a siege tank. This creature tastes like shit. <laughs> oh no, the Gorgon battle cruiser. What are we gonna do? Oh, wait a minute. Pretty solid. There's this single Chad Marine. He thinks he can take on the entire swarm by himself. There is safety in numbers. And also they they probably heard like through the Zerg vine what happened to Zagara and they're like, you know what? We'll just, it's fine. We'll just hang out. Banelings, hit the fucking wall. I literally only took you for that reason. The nice thing about spawn uh, or uh, Zergling reconstitution is even if we mine out the map, there's basically no way we can lose. We can throw Zerglings at the problem until we win. <laughs> it might take forever. Okay, so that's Hydra Den, Infestation Pit. I look away for one second! <laughs> it It's really funny to me that a Baneling would evolve a means for survival when its entire design was to be offensive and explodey like ah oh yes i would like to survive just long enough to blow up somewhere else she sounds like a mother children behave don't you dare make me turn this leviathan around good job reapers you died instantly providing basically zero value I'm pretty sure one of those tentacles just absolutely destroyed Rainer. Also, why'd they let this guy keep his pack of cigarettes in his sleeve? You'd think he'd be wearing like a security uniform. And like all the grenades strapped to his chest. Tell it to the millions you butchered. Billions, Jim. Billions with a B butchered. Alright, campaign's over, guys. I guess. Jim killed the Queen of Blades. It's nice talking to you. You know, we'll we'll start Legacy of the Void uh, tomorrow. Like this dude has shotgun shells attached to his chest. We, exactly. They took none of his equipment. His revolver had six shots in it. He just had all of his stuff. That that this cutscene is a little unrealistic. My bet is that they weren't willing to make a completely new model for Jim. Now that's those siege tanks. Oh, gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, gimme, gimme. Don't you fly away from me. Damn it. I wanted that science vessel so badly. Um, this is another mission where uh, I, I know a couple of decent cheeses that I would love to show off to you guys. However, on this mission in particular, the hybrid, the main enemy of this mission, are a separate faction. Uh-oh, oopsie poopsie. Hey, stop fighting me. So this one's one that you can just do this. Run the Zerglings in and then, or run the Zerglings in and then run them out instantly. And because of these two bunkers, there's basically nothing the hybrid can do. There we go. Aggro. Pull. There we go. Now he's in the base and we pretty much win. But yeah, like, all if not most of the hybrid in this mission can just be baited into Terran units and destroyed. Which is pretty fun. Karaga does a sick kick flip on her Nidus worm. <laughs> Hugs. See? Love makes the world go round. Oh. We're just gonna have her chip things down while we're busy. Three on... Gr uh, I kind of want to go Impalers. Impalers are really good at base defense. Oh, Queen! What it? I told her to place a Creep Tumor over here! Hey, look. Kerrigan wins. She always wins. 
I just... Did I just snipe Kerrigan with my... I... <laughs> Guys, no one saw that. <laughs> words cannot save you from the infinity bioforms I'm about to shove into your toilet. Did you guys see that? The Hawk evented! He talks a big game for having being pushed back all the way to his his uh palace. It's time you put your war face on. Yes, daddy. Warhounds are mean, guys. But Kerrigan is meaner. Drop these gu these suckers there. Bust the bunkers. And then A move across this base. Shifty shifty. Hide. <laughs> shifty shifty shifty. Hide. Shifty shifty shifty. <laughs> Hide. Shifty shifty shifty. Hide. Shifty, shifty, shifty. <laughs> Hide. And now we just rally everything we have into this wall. For humanity. Hey, humanity doesn't feel so good right now, guys. Oh no! It's the space glow stick! Why did Arcturus wait to use the artifact until the swarm had already destroyed his city? If it was that powerful, why would you not use it on the front lines? You absolute buffoon. 